at the bottom of the Danube River, in the village of Prahovo, on the Serbia-Romania border, lies the wreckage of a German ship. Its location now revealed due to the river's water drying up during drought times. This is one of about 200 German ships that were sunk in September 1944, during the Second World War. This one is the most visible. It flows to the surface, the most and two, three more ships appear below and that's it. The rest are mostly always underwater. The sinking of German ships was a war tactic of German Admiral Paul Wilhelm Zieb, who ordered the entire Black Sea Fleet be destroyed so that it would not fall into the hands of the Red Army. This operation was called the Elf of Danube. Navigation in this part of the Danube is difficult even today, and passing ships often take two to three hours. The ships were sunk not only so they wouldn't fall into the hands of the Red Army, but also to block the waterway. The ships were sunk to make it difficult to navigate that part of the Danube. Forty years ago, teams attempted to remove the ships, but during the operation several people died, so it was abandoned. Nowadays, better technology means better safety but it is still considered a risky operation. Very unsafe, very risky and very dangerous. There are also several tons of explosives there. A ship in low water when it goes along with nine vessels with 15, 16 ton propellers make vibrations. We don't know what can happen. The removal operation is expected to start in October and everything that is found will remain a part of the cultural heritage of Serbia. Aisha Yupi, TRT World.